Steris Endoscopy's single-use Infinity ERCP sampling device comes packaged sterile 5 per box. The labeling includes the following information, the order number, the product dimensions and specifications, lot number, date of manufacture, and use by date. Each sampling device is packaged in a plastic peel pouch. Open the sterile pouch, remove and uncoil the device slowly. Remove the plastic brush protector from the distal end of the device. Tighten the lure lock between the white handle and the gray Y port. Visually inspect the device for damage. Actuate the handle several times to ensure the device functions properly. Irrigate the guide wire lumen of the catheter with sterile water or saline. When using the device with a short guide wire system, allow the guide wire to exit the hole at approximately 20 centimeters from the tip of the catheter. Bending the catheter slightly will help to find the hole. If using the device with a long guide wire, Cover the hole at approximately 20 centimeters from the distal tip and advance the guide wire past the hole and through the lure lock fitting at the handle of the device. Advance the device into the accessory channel of the endoscope and relock the guide wire. Using short strokes, continue to advance the device until the distal end of the sheath is endoscopically visualized. Using the spool handle and thumb ring, slowly advance the brush out of the catheter and brush the desired area in order to obtain adequate cellular material. Brushing the desired area will be easier with the endoscope elevator lowered. When brushing is complete, retract the brush into the catheter and remove the Infinity device using accepted guide wire exchange technique. When performing salvage cytology, prepare a sterile 5cc syringe filled with fresh cytology solution and set aside. Afterwards, shake the brush in the specimen container. Cut the brush close to the bristles using an appropriate cutting device like wire cutters. Detach brush handle from the handle lure lock and remove the entire handle assembly with the drive wire from the catheter and set aside. Attach the 5cc syringe filled with fresh cytology solution to the handle lure lock. Flush the catheter contents into the cytology container. Repeat until the catheter is cleared. Follow by purging air through the catheter in order to evacuate any residual contents. Properly prepare the specimen per institution guidelines for cytological evaluation.